I believe we are now live. Hello everybody on Twitch. This is going to be going right onto YouTube, so let me do my YouTube intro real fast. Aloha kakahiaka means good morning to you. Aloha kakahiaka, ohaya gozaimasu, sao shenkao, and good morning to my jams and jellies. My name is Jelly Jam Jam. Welcome back to another video, and welcome back chat. Alright, I am super stoked to be here with all of y'all. We are hopping right back into the quest, Caretaker's Lunaments. So let's go look for that man so we can go ahead and get Aloha Mora. He shouldn't be too far away. It looks like he's relatively nearby. Um, real quick, let's check out what gear we got. We got a downgrade and a downgrade. We've got an unidentified item for the Room of Requirements and another one. I think we can hop to the Room of Requirements real fast because, because, because I also want to harvest my thingies. And I also have a treaty. My roommate's family went to Japan and they're so kind. They got me um, Pringles from Japan. This is supposed to be nori flavored or seaweed flavored. Dry seaweed, you know. I love nori. So let's, I'm, I'm so sorry. I don't mean to make this into a mukbang, but or mukbang, however you pronounce it. Not Korean, sorry. I wish I were Korean. Okay, give me one hot second, please. Oh wait, I did acquire flux weed. That's why Professor Garlic's thing works, because it said to get the seeds, grow it, and harvest it. I did harvest it, so I think I cheated, because I bought the seeds and I harvested it prior to that. Ha 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 ha, I am nobody smart but me. Hang on, let me try this. Delicious. I might be snacking on that here and there, so if I turn off my mic, that's probably why. <laughs> okay, moving on. I do not have the vivarium yet, which is for the beasts. Okay, let's see. What quests are there? Nothing new here. Nothing new here. Ah, uh, the caretaker's here, but he's in a different one. There, oh, there's the quest. It's the mermaid one. That's an easy quest. Easy. Uh, library. I don't have the flu flame in the library. Weird. South wing. Faculty tower. That's where Mr. Moon is. I think I can get there without getting lost. I think I can. I think I can. Okay, I'm gonna eat some more chips. Sorry. All right, let's go find Mr. Moon. Whoops, so sorry. Did not mean to do that, but it looks like he got hit. Um, where am I going? Careful. Bloody Baron? Be careful. You don't look like the Bloody Baron that I imagined. But I do see the chains on him, which is, you know, him. But why be careful, sir? I'm always careful. I think. Alright, we're going to the faculty tower section of the castle. Sorry, I wasn't paying attention. Um, sorry. Let's get my mic to make sure I was actually not muted anymore. Italians and a historian's uniform. It was brilliant. 
Yes, I'm glad you enjoyed that, Arthur. He's referring to one of our um, treasure hunts in the castle last time. Excuse me. Let me in. Let me in. There we go. Muted. Am I muted? Hello. I hope I'm not muted. Am I muted? I don't think so. Weird. Oh jeez, <laughs> don't do that to me. Ah ha 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 ha. Wait, viaduct bridge? Why am I going to the bridge? Just for that, I'm gonna munch on some chips then without muting. <laughs> I love ASMR. <laughs> Hmm? What was that? Oh! It's the Quidditch players. I heard the whoosh. I like ASMR. Hmm? Nelly. Could you remind me how the Dedalian ah. keys work again? When you spot or hear a flying key, you're to follow it back to its cabinet. Inserting it in the lock is the tricky part. I hope you follow some. If you open a cabinet, I'd love to know what you find, if anything. I hope they implement Quidditch. Oh gosh, and then it would be super cool if you could like... Figure out what uh, player you are. What's happening over here? Ma'am, you good? Is something bothering you? Okay, she's tweaking out. My NPC is broken. Hey, finally. Okay. Yes, I hope, um, you know how we take our quiz if I got figure out what house we're in, what our wand is, what our um, Patronus is? I hope they do that for Quidditch positions, because I personally would love to be a seeker. I think being a seeker is super cool. And I know Gareth is waiting for me somewhere. There he is. Hello, Gareth. Hello again. Were you able to get to Honeydukes? Speak of the devil. No, Gareth, I did not get to go to Honeydukes yet. I heard the key. I'm not doing it right now. Can't be too OP for Seeker, though. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, Hogwarts caretaker, at your service. First, uh, please allow me to apologize if I seemed a bit uh, unsteady when we last met. I'm afraid I had a rather disconcerting encounter. Although I hear your visit to Hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine. I suppose you could call it eventful. I certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack. Oh, of course not! And from what I understand, the village was lucky you were there. In fact, my recent visit to Hogsmeade is the reason I was hoping to bump into you. I could use your help with something. Do you see that curious statue over there? Watch what happens when that light changes from day to night. Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, see if you can remove the moon from the statue. Go on, take the moon. All right, let's go get that moon. 
little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed. Mm -hmm. Which, Gotta incidentally, go. can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now, and I'll explain more as we walk. All right. Um, thank uh, you for stopping by. Day in the village, I appreciate you, and I hope you have a good rest of your evening or day. And I hope you have a good week, and I hope to catch you in the next stream. Thanks again for being here. Appreciate you. You see, that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart, or, or shapeshifter, if you will, uh, which takes the form of whatever scares you most. This one took the form of a demiguise. A demiguise? <gasps> yes! Terrifying creature that can see the future. Wholly unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. Terrible experience. Uh, those statues are demiguises. The moons, I assume, are an uninspired play on my name. Some jackanapes used a boggart to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. I have my suspicion as to the scoundrel or scoundrels responsible. It is my hope that they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I, I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them so uh, I can go about my evening duties. Oh, no, I have to sneak around. The faculty tower? Oh, I'm not sure I should be going in there. Oh, you needn't worry. Uh, you'll be perfectly fine if you simply mind you're not seen. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. You'll want to do that before wandering the tower at night. Uh, next, you'll notice that the door is locked. However will you get in? Mm. Alahamora. That's how. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, ah, tosh. I sent you a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. Bad influence. And I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh. Oh, great. All right. Aloha, Mara. Let's go. Aloha, Mara. Sound of Book of Spells, Chapter 12, is what Hermione said. The good thing about Aloha, Mara is I don't think I have to set it into my thing. Aloha. Yeah, it's not part of my spell cast. There you go. I'm actually very good at those. <laughs> well done. Remember, use a disillusionment charm so no one claps eyes on you. I hate doing this. this. Restricted area of the castle. And I hate that I have to do this on stream. I hope you all appreciate appreciate what I'm doing for you. Because I hate doing these things. I hate doing these. I hate doing these. I hate that I'm doing it on stream.
Wait, how do I get them down here? Wait, how do I get them down here? Get them down. Avelia. I don't know how to get them down here. Nothing. I don't know how to get them down. I hate this game. Nothing? They're supposed to come downstairs somehow. I don't remember how. Nothing? You know, I'm about to look this up because I don't remember how to get them downstairs. you out of here. Nothing? Alright, I'm looking this up. I don't know. How to distract Professor Weasley and Professor... Who is that? Sharp? Yes, okay. Ignore them and sneak. What? Ignore them and sneak upstairs to the right? I don't think that's possible. Oh, poorly, I'd say. Yeah, that's so. We're raising a generation of coddle cake flappers that can scarcely tell the difference between Arcanite and Asphodel. Yeah. I guess early. I could. Interesting. Okay. Well, I guess I could have just ignored them. Hmm. Avelia. It says back to me. Okay, there's the door. Oh, going down. This 
must be the prefect's bathroom. Ah, oh, jeez. Just let me in. Okay, I don't remember how to sneak through here. So that's gonna be a separate problem in of itself. Do I just sneak past them? leave nope can I just leave about and the golden switch. Rather a lot like life. Okay. How do I get out of here? God, this is so stressful for me. Why did I do this? Oh my god. Hang on, I need a breather. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm freaking out. This is very difficult to do. Oh great, where did you come from? How do I get you to move? Do you move on your own or not? At least the one- or are you the one that was downstairs? Get me out of here! Avelia. God, this game is stressful! Uh-oh, did my stream reset? Hang on. Hello, Mr. Moon. I have the moons you asked me to collect. Oh, goodness! You're as fearless as I don't! An excellent start! If we can collect more, it may shed some light on who's behind all this. Of course, I first suspected Peeves. He drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxford, mm. does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. It's definitely intriguing. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. Uh, you, my friend, are a gentle person and a scholar. 
and I have something to offer in exchange for your assistance. Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. You mentioned offering something in exchange for my assistance. I did. Uh, once you've brought me enough moons, I'll show you even more powerful forms of Alahamora. Mm. Not every lock is as easy to pick as the faculty towers. Also, sorry, my stream disconnected from the internet, so it restarted a stream because I have no idea. So this is going to be interesting how I'm going to implement this to YouTube. I might have to put two streams into one video. How many statues are there to find? I don't know precisely, but I've spotted dozens. Seems they're everywhere I look. You have your work cut out for you, if you were to ever unravel their meaning. Understood. I shall keep an eye out. I appreciate that. All right. Oh, and I knew you were the one to ask for help. Uh, keep at it so we can solve this mystery. Yes, sir. Well, that was interesting. Um, sorry, both Twitch and YouTube, if my video seems a little buggy. I lost internet somehow, so my stream had to reset. My mistake, or my bad, I will figure something out for the sake of YouTube. <laughs> okay, here we go. Okay, I don't want to do that. Cast a pulso on a levitated enemy. Oh yeah, that's kind of far. I'm going to eat some chips, sorry. Revenia. Perhaps a hybrid. Bouncing tentacular. I finished the activities you assigned me, Professor Garlic. Wonderful! I hope you gained a greater appreciation for the flora in our lives. I am forever enraptured by it. Just yesterday, I spent hours pruning my self-fertilizing shrubs and flutterby bushes. Didn't realize how long I'd been at it until the sun began to set. Well, if there's one thing I love to see more than my plants thriving, it's one of my students doing the same. Now, ready to learn flippendo? Chin up, keep a light grip, and it's all in the wrist. Let's see you give it a go. You will want to focus with this spell. Nothing is mortifying as knocking back a colleague when all you wanted to do was move a few parts. Wonderfully done! If you'd like to practice a bit more- Professor, I was wondering where you're from. What's your background? Oh, how nice of you to ask. Well, I was muted the whole time, my bad. Right on the tents. So pretty much I just said yes ma'am to her cuz eh whatever. Forgive me. I was sure you must have been raised in the countryside. I used to dream of just that. But it wasn't until I came to Hogwarts that I felt truly at home. 
Mind you, it did take some time, and whilst it is my fervent hope that each student eventually feels as at home here as I do, it is not always the case. I suppose that makes sense. Well, we each bloom differently, don't we? Some of us, like Devil's Snare, thrive in the shadows, whilst others crave the attention of a bouncing bulb. And we each grow and thrive according to our own plan. Oh, I was terribly nervous when I arrived at the castle. You see, as a child, I knew nothing of witches or wizards. You can imagine how astonished I was to receive my letter from Hogwarts. I spent a good deal of time alone in either the greenhouse or the library my first days here. It does take a while to adjust to being here. Precisely, and I was remarkably fortunate. In fact, a seventh year took me under her wing during those first days. She remains one of my dearest friends. How fortunate. I was indeed. I dare say you'll find that the friends you make here at Hogwarts will last a lifetime. Now, I'd best get to my recent delivery from the Magic Neep. Mr. Teasdale promised me quite an assortment of seats this week. Lovely to see you. Alrighty. That was easy peasy. Neat. Alright, moving on. Sorry, also in the other greenhouse was just a bunch of um, venomous tentacula that's free for all, so I took advantage of that. Nice. Alright, so that's all of the stealth filled out. Chorus halfway, almost halfway, barely there, and absolutely nothing because I don't use <laughs> potions. Depulso. Do I have Depulso? No, that's from here. So I can't do this assignment until I do this assignment. But I can do this assignment, I think, if I did Keenbridge and Spires. Which I probably did. That's... Hmm. Should we do... Since my video is already going to be a little buggy, how about we do some side quests then? Or maybe not all side quests, but why don't we do some easy ones? So beast class is super easy. And again, I apologize that I forgot that I was mute, and I also apologize that I did not catch that my stream went offline for a little bit and started a new stream on its own. Sorry about that, everybody. And now my chips are all gone. Alrighty, let's head on over to Beast class. That should be fun. I like beasts. Care for magical creatures. Oh wait, did I not buy? Because I noticed when I was doing my first trial last stream slash yesterday's video, my thing didn't come in handy. Not you, not you, not you. I look forward to unlocking you. 
Don't really use you. I did have Swift. I wonder why it wasn't activating during my first trial. We'll find out. It doesn't work during, um, at Hogwarts, anyways. Alright. Oh, there's an elf over there. Get over here. Am I literally gonna chase it around? Nope. Hmm? Oh, little babies. Well, hello. What's over here? Gerald. Uh, Puffskin? That must be the professor. Level 2 lock, don't have that. Alright, let's do some beast class. Let's do this! Welcome, everyone. I see you've already met some of the many beasts we study in this class. Though be advised, none of these creatures should be taken lightly. They are all in their own way dangerous, especially if one does not know how to handle them properly. Now, it seems many of you are out of practice. Let's take some time to review the basics of how to care for a beast, shall we? Miss Sweeting, would you please assist our new student with the lesson today? Yes, Professor Howen. Hello, I'm Poppy. Poppy Sweeting. Don't worry about Professor Howen's speech. She over-exaggerates sometimes. <laughs> All the beasts in class are perfectly safe. Oh! Miss Sweeting, pay attention, please. The tongue of a pufkin can be a slippery devil. Uh, yes, Professor. Here. You can practice on Gerald. Just keep an eye out for his tongue. <laughs> you can use my brush. Just be gentle. Oh, and think pleasant thoughts. I like to think it enriches his experience. That's lovely. I'm sure he feels much better. I think he might be hungry. Would you mind giving him some beast? This is super cute. What do you suppose the pellets taste like to Gerald? Pudding, I like to think. I think we can safely say that Gerald likes him. That's good news. It's very cute. He seems very nice. He is. Kindness is one of his best qualities, right after ambition. And cleanliness. And Gerald is cute. Good work, everyone. Now, let's make our way to the pens and select another beast. Let's and do this. Please, do be careful as you feed and groom them. Alrighty. Miss why don't you show our new student to the measles in the farthest pen? This way. The measles are over here. Measles are cats. Wasn't Hermione's cat supposed to be part Neasel? Oh, Ooh, I'ma fight you. Neasel whiskers ought to get me a few canuts at least. Enough to buy something for money jinks. Stupid thing. What in Merlin's name are you doing? Tusk, tusk, peculiar poppy. Worried about a worthless little rodent. Her name is Persephone! <laughs> Her name is Persephone! <laughs> That's really not funny. <sighs> Let's go. The 
Those two don't belong anywhere near this class. Poachers and training. Persephone was on to them instantly. Thank you for your help. Let's carry on. Feed yes. and brush the measles, just as you did with Gerald. <laughs> the measles really took to you. They know a good egg when they see one. As do I. Aw, thank you, it Poppy. It appears our time has come to an end. Please close the pens and see yourselves out. Now, yes, ma'am. Where is our new student? Ah, there you are. I would like a moment, please. Sure, ma'am. Hello, Professor. You wanted to speak with me? I did. How did you find your first beast's lesson? It was wonderful. I believe I'm really going to enjoy this class. Good. You seem to understand that when beasts are properly controlled, they can play a vital role in our lives. Some provide us with magically imbued materials, if cared for correctly, which does not include torturing them for whiskers. Well done, by the way. Probably best to let me handle it next time. Yes, yes, professor. They're nearly as bad as the savages in Rookwood's poacher pack. Sadly, we're the ones who suffer. Stumbling over dead beasts. Terrible waste of resources. Surely the poachers can be brought to justice by someone. The Ministry, perhaps. Hmm. An optimistic idea. Now, why don't we focus on more immediate matters that we can control? Professor Weasley has asked that I prepare some assignments designed to help you catch up to the other fifth years. Be on the lookout for my owl. Meanwhile, I also encourage you to study as many beasts as you can on your own time. I need to talk to you. Come here. Coming, coming. Did you need something, Poppy? Thank you again for saying something to those brutes so that I didn't have to. You were an augury at noon in the desert. I certainly hope that's a good thing. It's something my gran and I say. It means that something or someone is a welcome surprise. At least, that's what we decided it meant. I couldn't stand there and watch them harm the poor thing. We're of a similar mind. Actually, in light of that, there's someone I'd like you to meet in the forest. You've intrigued me. Very well. Lead the way. I'd hoped I would. Alrighty, here we go. Come with me. Yes, ma'am. Waiting for you. This is gonna be fun. I wouldn't take just anyone there. In fact, you're the first. <gasps> Yay! Really? Well, thank you, I think. As I said, we think alike. Pleasant surprise. weather we're having, don't you think? Poppy, where are you taking me? It really is much better if I just show you. My Revelio's not working. For some reason it's reading as my top button. Don't worry, we're nearly there. It's I hope just so. ahead. I might, it might be time for me to get a new controller, actually. I've had this one for years. Oh, here we go. Let's meet the big baby. Stand back. That's a nice picture. She is perfect. Go on, introduce yourself to her. But be careful. You must always show hippogriffs the proper courtesy before you approach them. You must bow. I 
don't think I've ever seen a hippogriff take to someone this quickly. You can feed and brush her if you'd like. I come and check on her every once in a while. Bring Such her a pasties, cute baby. Tell her what's going on in the castle. You wouldn't know from looking at her, but she's a dreadful busybody. She's perfect. I love High Wing. Time to go! There we go, that's a better picture. Sorry, I'm, I'm thumbnail hunting, <laughs> if you can't tell. I had to borrow some so, pictures offline. What did you think Online? Of I thought she was brilliant. Can't believe you introduced me to her. I suspected you two might get along. Are you the reason students have been seeing hippogriffs flying above the Forbidden Forest? Hmm, perhaps. Did you know that once you earn a hippogriff's trust, they'll always be there for you? I've seen it firsthand with her. How exactly did you and Highwing cross paths? Sorry, it's I just hit my ring story. on the table. But I rescued her from poachers a few years back. Got her to safety and, well, she was fine until recently. You may have noticed that poachers are something of a problem in the area, so I worry they could get her again. And that I might not be there next time. Professor Howard mentioned the poachers as well. She seemed to imply that we couldn't rely on the Ministry to help. I don't often agree with Professor Howen, but on that, I fear she's right. The poachers' influence is growing. I see them every day in the village, lingering, talking to people. They're up to something. I'm just not sure what. That does seem strange. Sounds as if they're planning something. Exactly. I think I'm going to look into it. Find out what's going on, what they're doing. I think that's a fine idea. Information is power. And the more I know, the better I can keep Hiring safe. You seem undeterred. Will you let me know what you find out? Oh, very well. I will. I should be going, but we'll speak again soon, I hope. There we go. I was wondering why it wasn't working earlier. I thought I saw some behind Poppy up here. Yep, little toadstools hippity hopping around. Oh, what is this? Random treasure. Sorry, I'm such a little goblin. Okay, um, seeing that this is not going to be the best best of videos or streams, I think we can dedicate this to some more side quests. Um, I don't have to pulse yet because I don't do this one. This one I haven't done yet. Why don't we do some moons? And why don't we start? I'm going to use a guide because I don't want to waste too much time with y'all. Okay, we are going to Professor Fig's classroom. Professor Fig. Wait. There it is. Sorry, I don't know why I got lost. Okay, the first one that I see is in Professor Fig's office. I do think we saw that in my previous stream slash videos. So we'll go do that. I'm going to drink some more water. Everybody should hydrate. Sad, I ate all of my chips. <laughs> they were really good. Rebellion. 
We are going to cheat the time. Mine now, dummy guys. All right, that's one down. Next one, Divination Classroom. Divination. Okay, Divination Classroom. It's going to be on the teacher's desk. Gotcha. Then after, there's one in the restricted section. I think we can remember all of that, right? Divination classroom, teacher's desk, and then the restricted section of the library. Got it. of the assignments you set for me. Seeing the future is only part of what I teach my students. They must also be prepared for what the future may hold. Hence the need for you to complete certain tasks as part of your education. When you have finished the tasks, return to me and you will be able to learn Descendo. I shall be waiting. Palmistry model. This stunning model of a hand is demarcated to help students in the practice of palmistry. Depending on the angle at which the model is read, it either has a considerable lifeline or is likely to die in a fortnight. Oh, what is happening here? That's really cute. That's pretty cute. Very nice. There we go. Okay, restricted section is over here.
Ah, yes. Alrighty, that one is now done. Let us go. The Great Hall Room. Lock door, A. Eh? Oh, it only- okay, this one should be fine. Okay, we're going to the Great Hall. Uh, map. Great Hall, Great Hall. It's gonna be the back room on the right. I'm going to have to use Aloha Mora to do that. Okay. I think the south wing bathroom should be fine. I think that's also a level one Aloha more. I can't remember. But it's those haunted bathrooms. Aloha more. Alright, let's get into this one. There we go. Nice and easy, nice and easy. Go grab that one. Revenue. Chest. Yay! I needed that. Okay, the next one is the haunted bathrooms. Where have I seen those? Haunted bathrooms. Haunted bathrooms. South Wing. South wing. Ground floor of the Gryffindor Tower. Move through the hall until you find a locked bathroom where Peeves causes chaos. Okay, faculty tower, head downstairs. Okay. I should be able to do that easy peasy. I have a map. Women use maps. I should be fine. <laughs> oh, what is this? Clever. How offensive. Next. Oh, Hain, a genius. Happy Possibly, now. But I'll allow your limp vocabulary. This disillusionment charm is superb. I'm stealthy as a demigod. I'm in vi- uh, Ow! What are you Where are you going? What a stupid thing to kill? do! It's not stupid. It's oh, the most stupid thing anyone has ever done. Oh. Well, if you'd look where you're going instead of barging about. Uh, what are you doing? Okay. I'm assuming these are the right stairs. I want to go to the top because I want to find the Gryffindor room. There it is. I've been waiting for this moment. Alright, the fat lady portrait. This portrait guards the Gryffindor common room, requiring a password from any who wish to enter. She and her friend Violet are known to wander among other portraits, periodically helping themselves to vats of wine they're in. You're not gonna speak to me. Ooh, I wanted to go in. Oh, hello? Are you nearly headless, Nick? No, you're the bloody baron. Alright, well, I guess we're gonna go downstairs all the way. Getting dizzy, mind you. Because I have to get to the bathroom. Which should be around here. Yes, it's around the corner. I remember. Gotcha. Revenia. Here we I go. There we go. Alright, let's go ahead and check out the bathroom. Hmm, okay. Alright, 
moving on. Where are we going now? All right, next. All right, North Hall Dungeons. Ah, oh, this is where I always get bell tower, flu flame, sleeping dragon statue. Blah, 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 blah. I hate going to the. Ugh. I hate trying to look for the sleeping dragon statue. You should have seen me in one of my previous streams. It took me forever to find that stupid statue. Ugh. Well, hopefully I kind of remember where I'm going. If not, it's going to be yet another very long stream. I think we're going to try to find all of the demigod statues here in Hogwarts. And then, and then, and then. Technically this has already been an hour long. My previous stream that got cut off was like 20 minutes already. Mm -hmm. Oh, Peeves must be juggling flaming pinwheels again. Or not pinwheels, bowling pins again. Go left. Yes, I always miss the stairs. Okay, we're going to Muggle Studies. Which should be around the bends. Yep, there's a sleeping dragon, and here be Muggle Remember. Studies. Yep, I see the dummy guys. I don't know if I'm craving ice cream or cheesecake right now, but both sounds really good. There you are. Rebellion. There you are. Alright, important muggle artifact. This misunderstood artifact is supposedly important to muggle warfare, though most wizard kind is fine. Oh, thank you for following. I appreciate you so much. Um, important, hmm? Important to muggle warfare, though most of wizard kind find the prospect of wielding such a hefty weapon utterly head scratching. Thank you, thank you. How are you today? I hope you're having a good Monday. Okay, that's gonna be quite some ways away. Oh wait, I know. Are you also a level one? No, you're a level two. Of course you are. Um. Happy Monday. Oh yes, I can do finally do this thing. There we go. Alrighty, moving on. Rebellion. We are getting sidetracked. You sound awfully close now. Nice. Now to go backwards. Swiftly. Um, sorry, where are we going next? Okay, we just did Muggle Studies. Now we're going to the Bell Tower Ramparts. Okay. 
Outside to the bell tower, flu flame, go west toward the rampart gates, look for the right ramparts, and so you open them a little more to make a statue. Oh boy, okay. Looks like we're going to go outside. All we have to do is go backwards. Go up, then out. Oh wait, where am I? Oh, Professor Bins. History of Magic. Alright, History of Magic Windows. This set of stained glass windows features Merlin, the four Hogwarts founders, and various other witches and wizards of the age. Oh, level one unlock. Alrighty, here we go. Now where am I? I hear something fluttering. Revenia. Level two lock. Ah, there it is. I thought. Ah, there it is. Alright, Sphinx statue. The Sphinx, a beast with human head on a lion's body, has been used by witches and wizards for centuries to guard valuables and secret hideaways due to its intelligence and affinity for puzzles and riddles. Yes, I am pretty sure that... What was it? The... Riddle for Goblet of Fire was a spider, was the answer. Something about a spy, and then a D, and an ER was the whole thing for that. Revenia. Well, Professor Ben certainly has a collection, I will say that. A flu flame. I don't recall a flu flame being around here. Though I don't recall where I am. Not at all. Where am I? No, I was going the right way. I have to go out this door. There we go. Okay, now I know where I am. We have to go outside the building. To the school grounds. I have to go find one of the towers because one of the towers has a locked door and that locked door is going to give me another demigai statue. And after that I have to go to the gallery. And then... Beast classroom. But that needs level 2 Alohomora. And then that one I won't be able to get, I think. Maybe I can get Alohomora too and then that one. And then we can call stream, maybe, possibly, I don't know. Okay. Well anyways, we're going to the Bell Tower of Ramparts. I am learning so much about castle structures through this game. I learned what a viaduct is. I'm going to that building, I believe. Oh no, is it daytime already? Boo. Boo. I'm gonna have to fast forward time again. There we go. Moving on. What do we have here? The demi guys. I guess the game didn't register that it's daytime. All right, now we have to find the long gallery. Long gallery. 
Oh, it's gonna need the level two spell. Okay, defense against the dark arts needs level two and beast classroom requires level two. So I need nine moons. I think I only have seven, right? Hang on. Yep, I only have seven. Which means... I'm going to have to go around certain things. Sorry, I'm a sucker for side quests if you have not noticed. Just gonna hippity hop around picking up some side quests. I hope you guys don't mind. I wonder, I wonder, I wonder, can I? like a place right out of a storybook for now yeah sure but where oh, I take it you could you please remind me what you needed uh, oh I went my to go shopping Milo and I went to Acromantula's cave hoping to harvest its venom it didn't go well I barely escaped Milo wasn't so lucky I'm hoping someone can retrieve an heirloom from Milo's body to give to his little girl None the worse for wear. I take it you decided against entering the Absconder's cave then. Okay. Sorry. I thought I was downloading the wrong thing. My bad. Sorry. Well, I wanted to do something else, but hey. have to go to a castle across a bridge in the middle of the bridge there's a magical tree and I have to levio so it Seems got it to be some sort of map casually talking to a well got it um no, I'm not going to do that quest because it's far away. 
Rebellion. Again? I'm sorry, did my stream just reset again? I'm so sorry. I hope not. Let's go down the hill. Come on. All the way down. Yep, 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 yep. yep. Nope, that way. No, 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 that way. Wrong way! Okay, man. This way. Okay. Hey. This way. This way. That way. How hard is it to push a ball? Go. One done. Nice. All right, let's go check out that bandit camp up there. If I can. Oh, did I go up the wrong way? It looks like I did. Well, drat. Okay, walking around the other side of the mountain then. Hmm. There's a chest and I want the chest. That's all that I care about right now. Yep, my stream did reset. I am so sorry. I don't know what's going on with the internet today. I apologize. was fun. Super easy. Hey, level 24. Anything for me? No? Oh, there's a chest. Yay. Can I jump up here? Kind of. Oh. 
Nobody will believe I defeated an Ashwinder by myself. Yeah, and I'm almost dead. So I'm just gonna chill out for a bit while my health replenishes itself. Well, there we go. I always need room for a Wigan World. Speaking of Wigan World, look! Wigan World! If you hear dogs barking, I apologize. There's like six of them. Seven of them? There's a lot of dogs here. They don't like sirens. I apologize for all the noise. Is there any more loot? Nope. Whoop, falling. Alright, let's get this chest and mark this camp as done. There we go. There was something above me. And there's a siren passing by and a bunch of dogs howling. I apologize. Oh, it's just Wagon Wilds. Okay, moving on. Okay. Um let's do Madame Kogawa's assignment first. Did I get anything good? Nope, nope, nope. I'm gonna have to sell stuff soon. Not at Aaron Shear though. Junk. So much junk. Alright, um, quest. Okay. We're gonna mark that as our target so I can activate that flu flame. Oh, yeah, it's a good thing I'm flying because that's very far away. Hmm. I'm not too sure why my internet keeps bugging out today. I apologize for that, everyone. That's a lot of spiders. Shall we go fight some? relatively quick and easy. Alright. There we go. Alright, let's look for balloons. Big blue balloons. There's one. Ah, up, 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 up. Yeesh. Okay. A bubble. Ah. Gotcha. It's a track 
for practicing tatty. Nice bangs, good hair. Wish the broom had. <laughs> hello, hello. Thank you. Okay, pivot and down. Oh, there's a landing platform. I wish you could do a wheeled ones. I wish so too. That sounds pretty cool. a landing platform that I saw. I don't want to lose sight of it because those things are a utter pain to do and I think I've already lost it. Drat. Hmm. Well, that's okay. That's what maps are for anyhow. Oh, there it is. I was about to give up. Dual, wi dual wielding wand sounds like a good time though. Alright, the next one is very far away. Yeah, so uh, you're gonna have to stay with me for a little bit. My internet's been a little funky for some reason. This is like the third stream that's restarted. Keenbridge Tower. I kind of know where we are map-wise. Looks like these are the marshes. Although, let's consult a map. Just so I know where we are. Ah. I see. Maybe on the way back we can hit that spot. Looks like we found the balloons. Hey, look at that. First try. Alright, let's hit up this ancient magic hotspot. Because, because, because of all the wonderful things you do. We're off to see the wizard. The wonderful wizard of Oz. Oh, Oh, there's an astronomy tower up there. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. No doubt whatsoever. I need to get over here. Yeah. 
Trevelyan. Keep going. Oh, how far are you in the story? Hi, hello, peeps. Hi, Jelly. Hello, hello, hello. I am not very far. I just finished the first trial and I'm kind of sidetracked. Oh, that's right. That's a weird spot. Hang on. I'm dumb. I've done this before in a different game. Because you have to get in here, which is always weird. Ooh. Upgrade. Yeah, not very far in the story. Can I make that jump? I think I can. Ooh, look at that jump! Woohoo! Nice. Okay. Nice. All right. Um. Quest. Okay, that one's done. I just have to go back to her. To do this one, I have to do that one. I could go there. The well one is way far away. I could do this one while doing this one, but. The Boober Tubers quest hasn't started yet, which is kind of good. Alright, um, Hogwarts, let's go back to Madame Kogawa. Let's finish that off and cross that off the list. And then we can hop on over to... I don't know, I, I might call a stream there, only because I have been awfully... What's the word? Annoyed? that my internet's been going out. I've This is my third stream technically of the day. No, this is my fourth stream right now. I did a stream earlier today for about like almost two hours. I did a stream for 20 minutes before my internet went out. Then I was back on for 55 minutes before my internet went out. And now I'm currently in a stream that's almost 20 minutes long. I think this is gonna be the last stream of the day because my God, I've been doing this for quite some time. Ugh. This is so annoying. Uh huh. What's happening? Oh, thank you for following. You don't have to do that, but thank you. I appreciate you for being here. If you don't mind me asking, and you do not have to answer, where are we chatting from? I am Welcome currently back. streaming from have you Hawaii. Your assignments? Yes, ma'am. Level two lock. Don't got that. Reporting back, Professor. Assignments all finished. Well done. Shows good discipline. Wisdom is a golden snitch, as they say, and you're proving a skilled seeker in that regard. Let us practice our resto momentum. A resto charm, momentum. incidentally, created to stop quaffles from plummeting straight to the ground during a Quidditch match. Wow. Precise, deliberate movements. All right, um, Texas. Oh, nice. Just like watching Potter stuff. Well, I'm happy you're here. I had two other Texans in chat earlier today. I'm glad that you're here. Which part of Texas are you at? Because my friends who are here, their weather was crazy cold. I'm talking like they told me like around 20s. Hopefully you're much warmer. <laughs> okay, rest of momentum. The larger the target, the less effect the spell will have on it. Gotcha. Very good. I recommend it. Resto momentum. Spell as much as possible. Oh, it snowed. Oh no. Arresto momentum. That's it. Keep it up. Confringo. <laughs> Alright, let's talk to Madame Kogawa real Professor, quick. Do you have a moment? Yes, what is it? 
I am from Hawaii, so our weather has been really funky. At night, it's around 50s, and right now it's like 80s, so... In class, I heard you mention the Toyohashi Quidditch team. I did. The Toyohashi Tengu are from Japan. Dominant. Known for their rigorous training. A Japanese represent. The whoop whoop. School of magic, often battling both tempestuous seas and violent storms in addition to each other. Tournament play is almost always easier for the Tengu than their training sessions. I take it you're a fan. Fan? Huh. I was being groomed to play on their team. And I would have been a Tengu if not for a bit of bad luck. If you were that good, I can't believe a bit of bad luck could end your entire Quidditch career. I was excellent. My ability on a broom had nothing to do with what happened. I was betrayed by someone I trusted. Myself, before we were to show them our skills. Gosh darn it, did I go offline again? Hold up. I went offline again. I am so sorry. I don't know what's going on with my internet today. This is going to be my fifth stream of the day. I am so sorry. What the heck is happening? I do not know. Jeez. Okay, I am so sorry. But... Yeesh. Oh yeah, Texas has crazy weather. I can believe that. Liquid luck. That's illegal, isn't it? It is indeed. I knew within minutes that something was different. I had never played so well. And Asuka was playing more beautifully than I had ever seen. When I confronted her afterwards, she admitted what she had done. I withdrew from consideration immediately. But it wasn't your fault. You didn't know about the potion in the tea. It does not matter. My flying that day was not my own. I could not live with myself. So, I withdrew and explained to them why. I burned my broom in disgrace. What happened to Asuka? Did she burn her broom as well? Asuka played for the Tengu for two seasons. You didn't report her? Tell them what she'd done. Her fate was not mine to decide. My fate is in my hands, as your fate is in yours. Thank you, Professor. I shall remember what you've told me. All right. All right, that quest is done. What else should we do? There's not much else that we can do today. And I'm so sorry. I know that this stream just reset, which is awfully annoying, seeing that this is number five of the day. Um, why don't we head up to the room of requirement one more time? Ew. Okay, let's head up to room of requirement one more time. And then we can do... That one. Um, after I do room of requirement and harvest everything, I'm probably going to call stream because... I don't think it's fair that my internet's been going out like this and I kind of want to be like a better <laughs> streamer for you guys. I don't like that this is happening so often. I don't think it's fair. Yeah, I've already downloaded three of my streams to edit into another video. This is going to be stream number four that I'm going to have to download after the fact. Alright, let's go harvest. That's done. Where's my... There it is. Ooh, I see a lot of green. Let's go ahead and put that on. Alright. Nope. Nope. Yes. Heck yes. Nope. 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 Yes, please. Ew. Nope. Nope. 
Moving on. Nope. And uh, nope. Last but not least, outfit. Ooh, yes please. Hey, defense is off the charts. I love that. I hate how it looks. There we go. Like that one. Much better. Where are my gloves? Alright, I think I look much better now. Okay, map wise, we're gonna be doing Albies one. But before I can do Albies, I'm going to go to J. Pippin's potions to sell my stuff. And then, and then, and then. We should be all good from there. Yes, let's go to J. Pippin's Potions. We have everything a young student might need when it comes to potions. How Thank you, you Perry. Up? Lovely. I hope to see you again. Okay, we're gonna go to Tomes and Scrolls, so I can get me a large potting table for my venomous tentacula, and I think it was fluxweed. I could be entirely wrong on that, because I have a medium pot, because that's where my Chinese chopping cabbage is. Um, I need a large one first, because I technically already have two small ones. The one that is in the um, greenhouse, and there's one small one that has my m mandrake and the room of requirement. Ah. Tomes and scrolls, here we go. Nice, nice, nice. Just let me know if there's something in particular you're looking for. Um, yes I do, actually. I don't need any bee stuff yet, because I'm not there. T-shape, nope. Medium potion, nope. Potting with five small, nope. Potting with three small, nope. Two medium, nope. Medium, nope. Ooh, here we go. I need... Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? Agreed. That's great. Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. No, sir. Although, Albie's gonna have to wait, because I think I just spent all of my money. <laughs> Whoops. Okay, sorry, um, actually I think we are going to drop this quest because I'm going to go demiguise hunting next time if I remember that we are demiguise hunting.
Yes, so demigod's hunting. Let me spend my talent. Stealth is full. What spells do we get? I want to do this one. Okay, we're gonna drop the quest. We're gonna save and I'm going to call stream because something else has just popped up that needs my attention urgently. Okay, so for my Twitch stream, thank you so much for checking out today's Twitch stream. Thank you for putting up with all of the power, not power, just internet disconnections. I appreciate that so very much. And for YouTube, I will do my best to edit my streams all together. So that way it's going to be one big large video, hopefully not too long, less than two hours, hopefully. But with that being said, for my YouTube audience, like the video if you like it, just like if you just like it, let me know in the comments down below what you'd like to see from me next. Consider subscribing, being part of the pantry, and hit that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. My name is Jelly Jimmy Jam, and I will see you guys in the next YouTube video. And for Twitch, I will see you guys in the next stream. Follow me there so you don't miss a single one. All right, bye everybody.